Right, it is the first thing that everybody is talking about this morning. Multiple provinces and cities in southeast and even central part of China have felt the tremor of the earth. Well, here in Shanghai and the Yangtze River Delta, uh, many people have felt the buildings mildly shaking, especially for those uh, living in higher floors. And in southern province of Fujian, uh, people there have experienced a stronger tremor because it's the closest province in the Chinese mainland to Taiwan. And uh, some early warning apps uh, said that the tremor in the coastal region of Fujian province is equal to a magnitude 4.0 earthquake. And because 8 o'clock in the morning is often a time for uh, students to go to school and to start their first class, so we've also seen local media reports that many schools have evacuated students to outdoor spaces. But luckily, uh, no deaths and injuries are reported from Fujian province so far. And the earthquakes also influencing part of uh, the Chinese mainland's uh, railway networks. China's railway uh, administration have temporarily suspended part of the trains uh, this morning. Uh, those trains are, made, are mostly uh, connected uh, coastal provinces of Zhejiang, Fujian, and Guangdong province, but it's ex expected to be resumed by this evening. Dong Yin. All right. And um, uh, there should be, although the epicenter is not on the mainland, but uh, are there any reactions uh, from the Chinese mainland and the government? Right. You know, we often talking about the two sides of Taiwan Strait is uh, from the same family. And I think everyone in the Chinese mainland is deeply concerned of the situation in Taiwan. Right after the earthquake, uh, uh, we've seen people uh, leaving messages on social media platforms, hoping everything is all right there. And also the authorities also deeply concerned of the situation. Uh, China's uh, the, uh, state, uh, the Taiwan Affairs Office of the State Council have uh, uh, experienced uh, uh, the condolences to the compatriots affected uh, by the earthquake. And also the spokesperson of the Taiwan Affairs Office said that the Chinese mainland will pay close attention to the earthquake situation in Taiwan and are willing to provide relief assistance. Back to you mm. to the studio. Dong Thank Ying. you very much. Uh, we've been reporting from uh, Shanghai.